If you want to learn how to add Google Analytics to your website so that you can track what is going on in your website, what kind of visitors are coming in and so forth, then you'll need two things. Number one, you'll need to have a Google Analytics plugin in your WordPress blog. Number two, you'll need to have a unique Google Analytics account for your domain name. So first things first, what you need to do is go to plugins, click on add new, and we're going to search for a specific plugin, type in Google analytics here, do a search. And we're looking for a specific plugin by the creator of Kevin Sylvester. Now all these other ones here should work just as well. So if that one does not work for you, you can always try another one, but this is the one that we use. We click on install now, click OK, click activate plugin. And if we go under settings, Google Analytics, it's going to ask you for your web property ID. And you're going to enter that here. Now, obviously, we don't have it yet. So the second thing we're going to need to do is go to your Google Analytics account and create a new account for this particular domain name. So to access Google Analytics, you can go to Google, type in Google Analytics, and you'll get the URL here. Log in to your Google account, and then, of course, you'll see this page. Now, at this page, you want to click on Admin up at the top, and under Account, when you click this, you'll actually see, when you scroll down, all the way down to the bottom, it says Create New Account. Click that, and now we can enter the account name, the website name, the website URL, the industry category, the time zone, and you can check these or uncheck these, and click Get Tracking ID. So I'm going to go ahead and do that right now. And of course, before you can actually finish, you have to agree to their terms and service. So we're going to click on I accept and there we go. So now it's going to give you the tracking ID and the tracking code. Now you don't have to worry about the tracking code because we're using the WordPress plugin that takes care of all of this. All we need is this ID right here that starts with the UA dash number dash whatever number. So we're going to go back to the WordPress site under settings, under Google analytics, we're going to copy this code right here, click save changes. And that's it. You don't have to do anything else besides that. What this will do is it'll communicate with Google analytics. And as people come in, it'll analyze the traffic and Google will, will analyze that. And the way you access your data is simply by going back to Google Analytics and finding your website. And you'll be able to see all your information over there. And that's it.